Why do you brush your teeth? To clean my teeth. How often do you brush your teeth? Mm, twice a day. Do you have to be reminded to brush your teeth? Sometimes. I have a lesson about toothpaste. We're getting a lesson on brushing our teeth? No, a Bible lesson about toothpaste. They use toothpaste in the Bible? No, not exactly. Can you help me with this lesson? Sure. Can you get that toothpaste and plate over there for me, since my arms don't work? Got it. Now, use all your strength to squeeze all of the toothpaste onto that plate. Wow, that was some work, but I got it. Now, put it all back in the tube. You can even try using a spoon or toothpaste. Or toothpaste. It's uh, not going back into the tube. This is like our words. When we say something angry or mean, we cannot take those words back. Ephesians 4.29 says, Do not let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouth, but only what is helpful for building others up according to their needs, that it may benefit those who need it. What are unwholesome words? Those are bad words, like non-encouraging words, name-calling, or insults. What are building words? We can't build with words. Those are words, those are good words, that give praise like, Good job, keep trying, and you can do it. God speaks kind words to us even when we don't deserve them. Let's practice using good words. What would you say if your younger brother or sister comes in to your room without permission? Get out, dummy! Are those kind words? No. Okay, what about this? I'm busy right now. Can you come back later so we can play together? Good job. I think you're catching on. So, I need to use my good words even when I don't want to and when I'm angry? Yes. And remember, you cannot take your words back after you say them, just like the toothpaste. So you see, friends, you can't take those words back. Remember to think about your words before you speak. Don't let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouth. Only what is for building each other up. Let's pray. Dear God, I thank you and I praise you for the boys and girls that heard this story today. I thank you that we can use our good words and not our bad words. And help us to remember that when we get really angry or somebody comes into our room that we choose to use those good words. Help us all have a good week. In Jesus' name, amen.